What's up guys? How you guys doing today? So today guys, don't afraid to be different, have some fun and be yourself guys, but it is such a nice day outside. I don't know how warm it is, but I bet you Alexa can tell me what's the temperature? Right now, it's 24 degrees. Tonight, expect a low of 12 degrees. So yeah, it's it's pretty warm outside, which is pretty nice. So I believe after lunch John and I are just going to go play hockey in the driveway and then we're probably going to go in the pool and I think I'm going to be driving again today. So that should be fun. That's pretty much what I'm doing today. That's like the gist of the day. So honestly, I still have to fix my journals from yesterday. Like I, I well, not even from yesterday. I have to fix it from a couple days ago. Um, I have to fix July 5th, 6th, and 7th. Because I got a color in the Marvel thing, I have to tape that down, and then I have to color in yesterday's journal, like the little slushy thing. But my thumb is a lot better today. It's still jammed, and I think it's bruised as well. But like, it's okay. So, yeah, that's just a little bit of update. Because I told you guys in yesterday's video, I would tell you about my thumb today. So I'm gonna go downstairs and have some lunch. <laughs> So, there has been a bit in plan changes, so the plans have changed, so right now, it's almost 2, and I'm gonna go drive in that, that little parking lot again, so I'll catch back with you guys when I'm done driving. It's almost 3 o'clock, it's 2.48, and I still have to finish yesterday's video. I don't know, I'm sorry about that, guys, that all the videos have gone up late. It's just, I wake up, and then I'm like doing stuff, because we went driving, and yeah, so the driving was a lot of fun today, it was very, very fun. We ended up having the whole parking lot to ourselves, which meant I could go around the whole parking lot and go through all these stop signs and go around a couple cars when they were parked. So, like, there was, it's like a hockey rink and, like, a swimming pool, so cars were picking up people, so I went around the cars and all that stuff like that. But after John is having some snack, I don't even know what he's doing, but he's having some snack of some sort. But... After he has that snack, we're gonna go outside and play hockey. So, I'll catch you guys outside. So, some time has passed now. It's currently 7.05. And we went outside and played hockey. And then we came inside around like 4-ish. And then um, we ended up not going into the pool because we're going to be going into the pool right now. So, honestly, I ended up coming in and watching Murdoch. And then we had dinner, which we had chicken Caesar salad. My dad made chicken Caesar salad, which was so, so good. And honestly, apparently my mother said that like his chicken Caesar salad was so good because she, when they were dating, she had it. So... I don't know. I asked him if you can make it tonight, and he said, yeah, so we had it. And, um, but we're, and then after dinner, I just watched, finished a Murdoch episode, and now here I am, we're about to go in the pool. But, I want to tell you guys, I want to show you guys a little bit of a camera update. So, I have this one right here, the, um, my Canon SX720HS, and then I have this Olympus one which is a film camera. I have my Fuji Film Instax Mini 9, which I love this camera. I love taking all these Polaroid pictures, which I have all up here. And they're just so cool. Like they go all the way around. And um, I use like them for my journal and all different types of stuff. And then I have an old 1950s uh, Bencini Corolla Comet S and it was my grandpa's 
film camera and he gave it to me and then I have more two more film cameras here and then as we go farther down I got a little I got a drone down there I don't think there's any other cameras in here but if we go over here I have my big DSLR I'm not recording on it right now because it's just more handy to record on this one but I got my big Canon DSLR EOS Rebel SL2 it's such a good camera I love this camera I love recording on this camera and then we have um, a Panasonic and it's like a it's like a film camera which is it's really cool and grandpa also gave that one to me and then down here if I can find it it should be like right here yeah here it is so we have a Fujifilm pocket camera which my grandpa also gave to me which is really really cool and then over here I have my two so I before that I have my GoPro which I love this GoPro this GoPro is really really cool but and then I have this little like well it was like a pr pretty much a DSLR Fuji film and I have two of these they're different models though um, I believe this is the fine picks s a thousand and then this is just the uh fine piss fine picks s and this one is a better camera and they both have tri gorilla pods on them and then down here i have this um power shot this canon power shot and i'll probably bring this on the newfoundland trip and so yeah that's pretty cool so i'll probably end up bringing these two gorilla pods without the uh, Fujifilm cameras, probably this camera on my Newfoundland trip, this camera, my big DSLR over here, and then over here I'll definitely bring this Instax camera. So those are the cameras that you can expect, and probably also the GoPro. Those are probably the cameras that you can like, expect on the Newfoundland trip. So yeah, it should be fun, but there's a little camera update for you guys. <laughs> So I hope you guys enjoyed that little camera update because I do have a lot of cameras around here but I'm about to go in the pool right now and I'm going to wear these like little parrot um, I, don't, I think they're parrots yeah they're definitely parrots I'm going to wear these parrot swim trunks so I'll catch you guys when I'm out of the pool don't you, don't you know? inside from going in the pool it is currently 8 4 p.m. and it is starting to get darker outside but it is still lovely outside we had such a good swim for about like an hour and honestly it was good but I do not have to wear my finger thing anymore so it's I'm free pretty much from that finger thing but yeah so honestly I'm just gonna go downstairs and watch Murdoch so that's honestly probably what I'm gonna do for the rest of the night. So honestly, I don't know when I'll pick up the camera again, but I guess I'll see you guys then. All right, guys. So it is currently 20 to 11 right now, and I have done a little bit on the journal. I fixed. The, the journal a little bit so as we get to here so the Marvel logo is colored in to my liking and then I have the Polaroid picture on here and it's it's pretty good so I titled it learning to drive and then yeah so it's fully taped down but I still have to color in this slushy so I'll probably do that pretty like after I rec start record after I stop recording this but yeah so honestly this journal has been fun and I have to write today's journal shortly because it's pretty much the end of the day so I've been just watching Murdoch and after we got inside from the pool and 
that's honestly what I've been doing for the past little while. I had popcorn just and we were just watching. That's what I normally do, have popcorn. And yeah, so I should be getting to fix this little slushy thing. I got some crayons over here, like pencil crayons more or less, over here to color them in. Yeah, so I'm going to get to coloring this slushy. and I just got done finishing the journal for today so I decided to call it no more restrictions because that's of course like I like my finger is fine now and well it should be fine but I still have to tape it if I'm playing sports but I drew a hockey stick with a puck and a pool but it really doesn't look like a pool it more looks like a hamburger and I wrote pool not the greatest drawing with an arrow to it and this is like more like a diving sign I don't know I tried but I'm not the greatest drawer but today so I woke up at 11:40, went downstairs and watched Murdoch as usual and then I toasted an English muffin and with and it had peanut butter on it if you guys haven't if you guys do not know what an English muffin is I'll just pull up an image right now, and if you guys have never had it with, um, with, like, peanut butter, you're missing out, honestly, because it's so good. Here we go. This is what an English muffin looks like. So, there's the English muffin, and then let's see if, uh, with, there we go, peanut butter, and... Yeah, see, that's what I had minus the, uh, like, all that stuff. I pretty much had, so, like, that, but without, like, all, like, the honey and the strawberries and the, um, bananas. But, yeah, so that's what I had. I had a couple of those this morning for lunch. Well, it was more or less the afternoon. And then, um, we went out my mother took me out um driving at ray 20 uh which is like the little hockey arena so we went driving down there and it was really fun i got to we like i said before we had the whole parking lot which that meant i could go around and drive around and it's like 20 kilometers per hour so i got to go up to a bit over 20. So it was pretty fun just getting to cruise around and learning how to do like going to a stop sign and turning and all that stuff. So it was honestly pretty fun and the the parking lot was pretty empty and then there was like the drop off near and pick up near um, near like the sw there's a swimming pool with the hockey arena and the so the, there was people dropping off their kids to go to the swimming pool. So I had to go around those cars. And so it was like a little bit of an obstacle, which was like my first experience with like uh, a parked car, say less. But it wasn't really parked. It was just like has its had hazards on. And so it was just pulled over. So I just had to pull around that. And then I also had my experience with a car passing me today. So I had to like stay to the left and was on a like a little bend a little bit. So um, yeah, so it was honestly pretty fun driving. But we also, so I got home after that and um, we played hockey with John. And it was fun, it was hot, but it, honestly it was fun. It was the first time we've played hockey in about four weeks because I had my broken finger and then it was I don't know it was just really really fun but I always bothered John during the exams and everything when I had my broken finger I always told him John let's go outside and play hockey and then 
he would realize that my finger was broken and then I asked him today he was really confused but we played out we ended up going outside to play hockey which was really really fun but I did have to tape my finger so that's like I don't know it's still healing but the doctor said on Wednesday which is in like the day after this is posted which is when I can like officially go back to playing sports so I just have to tape it up and then if it hurts just call them and then we'll figure out what what's going on about it but honestly it feels so much better but and then after we played hockey we, we came inside and um and then we had dinner and we had my dad made a chicken Caesar salad and um like I said before um my mother said it was like her favorite thing when they were dating he used to make it all the time so I heard about it and I pressured him to making it today so it was really really good we it was like the Caesar salad had parmesan and then it had like a little uh, bit of like an egg and lemon little um, dressing over it more or less it was like mixed in it was like um, it poured it over um, so it was really really good but yeah so the Caesar salad it was really good and we had chicken over it on the barbecue this is like the first time I've had this type of chicken and it was just laid over the salad and and then we had I think it was balsamic over top of that which was so good it was just overall really really good but and then we uh, we came after the pool the um, after having dinner we went into the pool and then the pool was really really fun John and I ended up playing like a bunch of games like usual we played um what we call water hockey where we just i don't know why we call it that but we we play like goalie and we just throw the ball around and we create like net more or less to say we play basketball we play keep it up with like a big beach ball and then after the pool i came inside and watched murdoch and then that was pretty much my day so that was honestly my day but these journals are getting more fun writing them and I'm going to show them to my nanny this summer which I think she'll be like pretty like she'll be pretty happy to see them because she doesn't really see us often and if she like if I tell her what happened during my summer and I have it all written down and she can read it and see what I did I don't know maybe she maybe that like I don't know she'll she'll just like find enjoyment to that I think I hope but I don't know but yeah, so I don't know what else I'll be doing for the video, but I'll catch you guys then. pretty much a very very fun day today but it is getting pretty late and honestly I do not know what I'm doing tomorrow but I know John is going over to some house for his friend's house for a pool party so honestly I'll probably just be chilling here just relaxing which I've pretty much done the whole summer but it's okay it's pretty fun just relaxing because the school year is like 10 months and then you get like two months just to have a fun summer so that's pretty much what i've been doing and then three months of that summer is spent in newfoundland which i thoroughly enjoy i don't know newfoundland it's just a different spot like i don't know when i look at this picture it just gets me happy and just wanting to be there but yeah guys so it looks like it has come to this part of the video where i I do believe that I'm going to have to thank you guys so much for watching and I do hope you guys enjoyed and if you like to watch another video guys please subscribe to my YouTube channel turn on my post notifications and smash that like button smash see you guys peace out I will see you guys in tomorrow's video